pretty cute. And you heard about global warming, okay? It's like the big problem now, and that the CO2 and coin emissions have started warming up the air, and it's melting the polar ice caps, and polar bears are starting to die out, and Al Gore made a movie talking about global warming and how bad it is, and how it's all because of coin emissions, and we have to stop coin emissions, and we have to do something. We have to stop these companies from laying out all these smoke and gases that are polluting the air, that are making it warmer. Teachers told their kids about that. Scientists even back up what Al Gore saying. And then you hear people on the, new, on the TV and news saying the same exact thing. Well, everything that he has said is a lie. Because if you go back in history, okay, when the ice age was, okay, there was absolutely no cause of the ice age. Is it the nothing messenger? started it. Is it the message? Like, there was no cars back then, no industries were back then, no gases were in the air, animals didn't poop to start it, okay, nothing started, it just happened, okay, there was no reason why, you could go back in time and say, oh, the ice age started because of this or this, because there's nothing that pinpoints why it started, okay, you can do research for billions of years, Okay. Is it the research you might find some, okay, lack but of the main part of is it the ice stage didn't start, okay, for any big reason, it just happened, alright, and now, okay, we're in what you call the heat age, heat wave, or what global warming age, if you want to call it that, okay, and what is the all that is, is that the, the sun is warming up the earth even more than it usually is, and it's just, the next time period that the year goes here, because it goes through different times. It goes through the, the ice age, frozen air, cold age, whatever you want to call that. Then it goes through the heat age, global warming age, warming up the earth age, whatever you want to call that age. Maybe and it goes right, through the cycles, through so many years, wrong. okay? The Which, I don't know how many years it's been the between the ice age and now, but nevertheless, However many years it goes through, it gets to another period of time. The so after this war age goes by, we're going to get into it the ice age again, where everything's frozen again. So it just happens like that, okay? Yes, the CO2 and coin missions might contribute to making it a teeny bit warmer, but it's always been getting warmer. If you look at past history, before the Industrial Revolution, you look at Greenland, Greenland, it was a frozen land. It had snow and ice, okay, and it was always frozen. And then it started to warm up, and the ice and snow started to melt, and then people could start farming on there and live on there longer. So, it had nothing to do with cars or mission or anything. Starting global warming, the Earth has always been getting warm. It's just been now where it's at its peak right now, where it's starting to get warmer and warmer, and ice caps and stuff were starting to melt and now it's becoming like a big problem for everyone when it's not really that big of a problem. Let's turn off the computer so we, we can just have to do some more research if Let's you take don't believe what I'm saying, okay? But uh, the global 